Hi everyone and welcome back to our channel. If you're on the home buying journey, a big question you might be grappling with is whether to go for a new construction or a resale home. Both options have their unique appeal and set of challenges. Today, we'll dive deep into the topic covering costs, benefits, and everything in between to help you make an informed decision. So grab a cup of coffee and let's get started. Let's start with the charm of older resale homes. Resale homes often exude a unique charm and character. They are nestled in established neighborhoods with mature trees, a sense of community, and a slice of history. So let's start with the pros of a resale home, okay? So first, character. Unique architectural detail and a sense of history that new homes might lack. Second, established neighborhoods. You're gonna have mature trees, developed parks, and long-standing communities. Third, lower initial costs. Generally, lower purchase price compared to a new construction home. Number four, immediate availability. No waiting period as the house is ready to move in. Now, let's move on to the cons of resale homes. Number one, outdated systems. So this may require updates or renovations to modernize. Number two, maintenance. Older systems might need more maintenance or replacements. Number three, less energy efficient. Often lack the latest energy saving features unless upgraded. And lastly, less customization. What you see is essentially what you're gonna get in that home. Now, shifting gears to new construction. New construction boasts modern design, energy efficiency, and the opportunity to customize. So let's start with the pros of new construction. Number one, modern design. You're gonna get sleek designs with contemporary aesthetics. Number two, energy efficient. Homes are being built to the latest energy standards, saving on utility bills. Number three, lower maintenance. Brand new systems, reducing maintenance costs initially. Number four, warranty. New homes often come with warranties providing peace of mind. And number five, customization. You're gonna have the ability to choose your finishes, fixtures, and sometimes even your floor plan. Now let's move on to the cons of new construction. Number one, higher initial costs. Generally, homes are gonna be priced higher than resale homes. Number two, developing neighborhoods. You might lack mature trees and establish that established community feel. Number three, smaller lots. Homes are often going to come with smaller lots and the proximity to your neighbors are going to be a little bit closer. And then lastly, your wait time. You may have to wait for your home to be built. One significant pivot point is the $500,000 mark, okay? So around this budget, you might find that new construction becomes more attainable, offering more space and better community planning. And this often tips the scale in favor of new homes for buyers who initially lean towards resale homes due to the budget constraints. It's crucial to weigh these pros and cons against your personal preferences, lifestyle, and long-term financial goals. A trusted real estate agent can guide you through the process, ensuring you make a choice that aligns with your objectives. Thank you for joining me in today's deep dive. If you found this video helpful, hit the like button, don't forget to subscribe, and ring the bell for more real estate insights. And remember, I'm here to assist you on your home buying journey, so feel free to reach out. Until next time, guys. Bye.